soon make a video showing you how you can potentially sell your home. I'm a real estate agent and I'm providing this information for people who are interested in selling their home on their own and don't necessarily want to use an agent. So please make sure to hit like, share with your friends, and subscribe. In this video, I'll be going over the tips and tricks to help you sell your home on your own. So what's the first step? The first step is to declutter your home. You want to show all the space in your house and make people visualize themselves and feel like they could imagine themselves in your home. Part of that is to remove as much clutter as you can, remove family pictures or anything that really has your family name. You want to think of making your house like something off the shelf where people could just walk in and imagine themselves living into it. Once you finish decluttering, you want to also consider hiring interior designers. The interior designer will come to your house and help you orient objects and put things in certain ways to highlight features of your house and make your house feel even more open and comfortable. Interior designer, there are different rates in different areas and depending on the services you want. So if you're interested in that, please make sure to send me an email and I can provide that information depending on where your home is located. Once you've decluttered your home and you've hired the interior designer or done that by yourself, you want to make sure you're pricing your house correctly. If you have a lot of time and you want to maximize every single dollar you could potentially get, maybe you want to price your house higher. If you are in a quick buying and want to sell your house quick, you want to be aggressive with your pricing. Now, how do you know if you're pricing your house correctly. I could potentially give you a comparable market analysis. In this analysis, I will look at recent sales in your particular neighborhood for a house similar in condition and type as your home. This information will really be beneficial to you because it can make sure that you are pricing your house how you want to and at the right condition for the current market. The market changes day to day, so it's really important to make sure you're pricing your home correctly. Another thing I could help you with is that if you currently have a mortgage on your home, I could help you calculate how much money you will get in the end once your house is sold. Apart from paying off the current mortgage that you currently have, you will also have to be paying for escrow and title, and I can help you calculate those costs and figure out what would be the net gains that you get after your entire sale. The next step is to look at disclosures. As a seller, you are required to disclose the condition of your home of what you know. If you know something and you don't share it, it's an omission and you could be held liable for that. So you really want to do a really good job with your seller disclosures and just share everything because it is a big deal and you don't want someone to come back and sue you for something that maybe it wasn't even a big deal but if you know that's been a repair in the house or a nuisance or something like that you want to make sure you list it in your seller's disclosures you also want to work on video and photography the video maybe that could be seen as extra but the photos are extremely important why? Well, these days most buyers are just flipping through photos and deciding what house they want to see based on that. It's really hard to get into homes right now due to COVID, so most people only want to let people into their home after they've seen all the photos. You want to hire a photographer for this that specializes in taking pictures of homes. And since you have already done your interior designing and decluttered your home, the photographer can really help you attract people to your home. Depending on your area, I can also, also share this information of vendors that do home photography in your specific area. So please make sure to send me your email. Now you have your photos and you're ready to display your house on the internet. Well, you might want to talk to me so I could help you enter your home into the MLS as an entry only or a basic 
listing. Usually, a real estate agent that puts your house on the market is able to broadcast it to all different websites. This is very beneficial for a home seller because it attracts high qualified buyers. When you're putting your house out there on your own, it's not necessarily listed just directly to buyers. So there is less people that get exposure to your home. For a basic fee, I could potentially enter your home in the MLS to give you that exposure even though you don't have an agent. Of course, please note that your agent wouldn't be liable for anything like this. This is just, they would just be entering it as into the MLS as a basic service. This varies state by state. Some states people are able to just enter it as a full listing for you for a specific cost. But in California, that's not allowed and it has to be done under a broker. All right. So once we've done all that, I really highly recommend that you hire a real estate attorney. A real estate attorney will help protect you once you start receiving offers. That there's nothing that could be used against you or that there's some clause by a buyer that will put you in jeopardy. And your home is a very precious asset. It's a very expensive thing that you own. And it's for most people is the most expensive purchase. So you want to make sure you have a real estate attorney that can help you make sure the contracts are all good and there's nothing that's going to harm you and put you in a bad position. So I've shared all this information with you. I hope you found it useful. Please make sure to send me your email if you're interested in receiving my free home seller's guide that can also highlight some of this information and you could have for yourself. If you have any other questions or you're considering buying a house after you sell your home, I hope that you can come to me and that I can provide listings to you uh, with your information and your criteria. Thank you for watching my video and have a great day. Ooh.